What's up everyone? I'm Steven here with Tiny House Listings bringing you another video today uh, here from the Tiny House Listings Warehouse. We are in a tiny house, a 24 footer. Is yes, sir, yes sir, 24. Underneath, under construction. Um, so I just want to show you a couple ideas. The guy who did this wanted a little bit different layout. And um, so here's a couple of different things that he decided to go with on this tiny house that you can do for yourself. If you look back here, you can see that Whoa. <laughs> under construction. Under construction. Typically above the bathroom, we do a loft. He did not want a loft above there. He wanted to have high ceilings in the bathroom. So what he did was uh, had the wall go all the way up. So there'll be no loft over the bathroom. So when you walk in, you'll be able to see the same ship lap that we do in the ceiling here will actually be the same thing that you go to the bathroom. But what he wanted on the front here was a really nice big shelf to replace it. that will come out here in the kitchen. So you'll be able to put some stuff up there. Uh, and then also, if we step foot in the bathroom here real quick, you can see he has the new layout that we've moved over to. About a week or two ago, we did a new video for this, but what we did was we moved the bathroom out about six inches, and what that allowed us to do is, on this one, you have the, uh, let's see, the toilet goes here. No, no, no. Yeah, toilet. The toilet goes here. And then you have your 30-inch vanity over here. You have a 30-inch vanity here. And so then... on this side. And then on this side, you'll have the shower here. Yep. And then you'll be able to have your washer and dryer here on this side. Yeah. So what will happen is the whole entire middle will be free for uh, for changing. You'll just have a lot more free space. And we were able to do all that just by adding, taking away six inches from the kitchen area. So it was definitely worth it. Uh, here, if you add that up, that's 148 of the whole length because the 28, this is a 24 footer. Um, but when you walk in here, if you kind of look up, it's really kind of hard to tell because we haven't put the ceiling on yet. But you'll be able to look, you'll be able to have a high bathroom by foregoing the storage loft above. Now, some people will like that, some people won't. A lot of that depends on how many belongings you have. If you have a lot of belongings, you might want to keep that storage uh, loft up there. Uh, but I think this will look really good. And when we get a little bit further along, or when this one's closer, we'll shoot another video and show you what that looks like. Um, another option real quick right here that he didn't do, but you can do. If you look in this back wall right here, there is a, this is your kitchen area, but this is looks out. So if you have a pretty view, we had one person recently do this. He had a pretty view over into the woods in the property he owned. So he elected to have two windows here, um, which really doesn't hurt you the bad because if you think your couch is about this high, your bed's that high, so it's not, So all it does is allow you to see and have a much better view of the back. So that's another option you could do. Um, but yeah, just wanted to show you a couple options that you have in this particular 24 foot model tiny. If you have any questions, email us at build at tinyhouselistings.com or you can go to tinyhouselistings.build and you'll be able to see, you'll be able to actually configure one of these model tinies or one of our lads, get a price, and you can hop on a sales call uh, with us and we'll be able to talk it through. But uh, either way, thanks for watching. See you on the next video.